What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix Wi-Fi connection problems in iOS 18. If you've been having trouble connecting to Wi-Fi on iOS 18, you're not alone. Some users have reported connectivity issues after updating to iOS 18. But don't worry, there are a few easy fixes that can help solve the problem. First, the quickest and easiest fix you can try is restarting your iPhone. This sounds simple. But restarting your device can often resolve minor software glitches or bugs that are messing with your Wi-Fi connection. To restart your iPhone, press and quickly release the volume up button, then the volume down button, and then press and hold the power button until you see the drag to slide off screen. Drag the slider to the right to shut down your device. Afterwards, press and hold the power button until the Apple logo flashes back on. A successful restart might solve the Wi-Fi connection problem. If restarting didn't fix the problem, the next solution is to forget your Wi-Fi network and reconnect. This essentially refreshes the connection between your iPhone and the Wi-Fi network, wiping out any old or faulty data that might be causing the problem. Head to your settings and then tap on Wi-Fi. Find the network you're having trouble with. Tap the little eye next to it and select Forget this network. After that, go back to the Wi-Fi list, choose the same network and enter the password to reconnect. This often resolves any connection problems, especially if the network details get corrupted. If you're still having issues, the last method you can try is to reset all network settings. This is a bit more comprehensive, and while it won't erase any of your data, it will reset all of your saved Wi-Fi passwords and network configurations. It's a clean way to troubleshoot deeper issues that might be affecting your Wi-Fi connectivity. To do this, head to your settings, Tap on General, scroll down to Reset and select Reset Network Settings. You need to enter your passcode and after confirming, your iPhone will restart. Once it's back on, reconnect to your Wi-Fi and that will fix the problem. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.